Well, I don't really know if I'm going back anywhere because you can't really go back. First show of uh, of the new record is, uh, is on 21st of May. Um, are you already dreaming about that evening? I spent this morning. I spent time thinking about it because, as you say, it's getting really close. Up until now, it's been about getting the record out, and the live thing's always been, you know, the the. The other fifty percent of it, but um, today I really started to to think about it because it's um, in one ways it's a little showcase tour, you know. It's it's eight or nine dates and it's in tiny clubs. So I said, well, you know, you're used to you can handle these things, but in fact, it's the first time I've played with a new band and played essentially 16, 17, 18 songs. Never played sung live before nothing. So it's a big, big challenge. And I love, really love the whole Lost Boy experience. And just as I wanted it to get off on the right foot for the record, I wanted to get off on the right foot live as well. So um, it's gonna have to be really good. Okay, what, what does a what makes a show good? Is there something that needs to happen or...? Well, if you start with a very basic, it's so obvious thing to say it sounds banal, but, but it is, you know, you've got to get the... You have to have the music with you first. It has to be... The music has to be really something. And, 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 and something that can work on a, all the different levels. You know, melodic, powerful... Um, the whole thing should, it should be a bit transcendental. Transcendental. You go in there and you forget your life. You just get pulled into the music and, and you're gone. Um, but these, this is all about hopefully showing the potential of, of what can come from Lost Boy. Okay. Is, it, is playing in a, in a more intimate setting, uh, like a club, is it more difficult than playing in a huge arena? Or? In a way it is. In a way it is. Because in a huge arena, you know, you have all the budgets of technology and, and you can, especially the modern arenas, they're, they're, they're kind of, um, a lot of them are built now, you know, specifically for music. Whereas in a club, you know, there's no production involved. It's you and your skill and your wits, tiny space. And, uh, you, you, but, you, but I think the greats, if you're any good, you should be able to do a bar, a club, a birthday party, a bar mitzvah, a wedding, a stadium. If you're any good, you should be able to do it. Did you need it maybe uh, uh, for, for a change, a little bit more intimate setting after all those years with Simple Mind? I needed a blank page. You know, I needed a blank, blank, blank page. I wanted, I, I, when I say needed, that. The unfortunate, that seems to say that there was a frustration within Simple Minds. There wasn't. I really, you know, especially lately, Simple Minds have been getting the mojo back again. It's been really good playing arenas, great catalogue of songs to, to, to work with. But Simple Minds moves at a certain pace and it has periods of activity, then it has long periods of inactivity. And deciding, me deciding to work these periods of inactivity for Simple Minds, I decided that I was going to do do something that one of the one of the exciting things would was that it would have a blank page, uh, which is the opposite of Simple Minds, and so therefore it's nice to have the balance of the the two of them. If the intention is to try and make them work in parallel. So what what, what do you actually mean with, with a blank page, and like starting all over again? From exactly. The start? When I say a blank page, I mean from starting all over from the start. And, and as I said, playing with a brand new band, playing songs no one's ever heard live, playing without a track record of chart success and, and uh, history and tradition, playing on your wits. This is us tonight. This is our new music. Um, hopefully it impacts you the way it impacts us. Uh, and you'll go and tell your friends. That's how Simple Minds started.